welcome back to crafting in the chaos my name is Ashley and today I'm going to show you how to make this really cool beehive using mostly Dollar Tree products this project will probably take you about 30 minutes it's really quick really simple and really cheap so let's get started so for this project, you will need a flower pot. It can be any size that you prefer. You will need flowers of some kind. Um, you can use daisies or sunflowers, whichever you prefer. You will need three rolls of the nautical rope. You will need a piece of black felt, or you can use a black Sharpie. You will need bees, which I ordered these off of Amazon, and they are little thumbtacks. And I will have a link in the description below so you can order these off of Amazon. You will need a pair of scissors and you will need your glue gun. So you'll wanna begin gluing your rope around the base of your beehive. Um, you can use E6000 glue, but I prefer the hot glue because it seems to stick better and faster. And for this kind of a project, you definitely want it to stick fast. So you will continue wrapping until you have completely covered the entire flower pot with the rope. Once you have your beehive wrapped, it should look somewhat similar to this. Now that we have that part complete, we need to make a circle for the beehive entry. So you'll take your piece of felt and you will cut a circle. It does not have to be a perfect circle. So once you have this part cut, you will want to locate the seam where you connected the two ropes together, and that is where you're going to want to place this. You're going to need some more nautical rope for this part to wrap around the beehive entry this is why you didn't need to make a perfect circle so you'll want to start by gluing down one end of it and glue the whole way around it until the other end so that way you have an idea of how big you need to make it and then you want to make the cut And now we are going to add our flowers. You can glue them any way you'd like, but this is how I prefer to do mine. And now it's time to add our bees. You can glue these on there or you can easily just stick them on. Some of mine are glued, 
some of them are not so that way you can remove them and put them elsewhere on the beehive. Now this next part is optional. You can take more of your nautical rope and you can add a loop to the top of your beehive to hang it. You don't have to do it, it's an option. You can either let it set on a table or you can hang it up off of a hook. And here's our final product. Isn't it just cute? Oh, I love this. This is going to go perfect with some of my decor. Absolutely perfect. I love these little bees. These little bees are absolutely perfect. But what's nice is you don't have to use this size of a pot. You can use a bigger pot. You can use a smaller pot. Um, there's two different sizes of rope you can use. This is the bigger size. You, they have a, a thinner one too. You can change the flowers. You don't have to use the same flowers. You know, it's, it's just, it's so, there's so many different things that you can do with it. And then the loop. Like you can hang it up, you can leave it sitting down on a table. Like it's just, it's absolutely adorable. I cannot get enough of this. So cute. Look at that. Just perfect. Well, that's all for this video. Please stay tuned for a sneak peek of next week's video. Please like and subscribe to stay up to date on all my future videos. Have a great day, y'all.